Okay, so today's video, I'm tackling not one, not two, but three different rooms in my house. If you're new here, my name's Nicole, and I am on a journey to get out of this midlife rut that I'm in. And the first thing I'm doing is decluttering my house room by room. I feel like the clutter in your home is just a manifestation of the clutter that's going on inside of you. And so in order to make room for me to be able to work on myself, I just gotta get everything taken care of in my environment. And then I can start working on the stuff inside of me. But anyway, if you are coming back, thank you so much. Uh, and I do appreciate all the well wishes and the sweet comments that I've had. You guys are a wonderful group. And I know that all of us are kind of going through the same thing. Um, and so I appreciate you following along on my journey. If you saw my last video, <laughs> I apologize. I am learning this new camera that I got for Christmas and I always have my husband and boys watch the videos after I upload them to see how they, what they think. Maybe I should get them to watch them before I upload them because it was awful. So hopefully I'll get better at this camera and won't have that problem anymore. You'd think it, if I was wearing my glasses, I'd be able to see it, but huh. Today's video, I'm tackling three different rooms. My twins, who are 11 years old, wanted to have their own rooms for Christmas, but they also wanted new beds and they wanted a really nice mattress and really high quality sheets. So that's pretty much all they got from us this year. And in order to make that happen, we had to move a lot of different things around because we had a sofa that was in our sitting room of our master bedroom. And I had to move my desk into that sitting area and that's gonna become my new office. So I needed to move the sofa back down to the basement where its partner is. So I had to clean out the bonus room in the basement so I could put that sofa back down there. And then we had to clear out the two bedrooms to make it for their rooms. The treadmill that's in the, the exercise room and the office, we're keeping the treadmill. So I moved it into my husband's office. And originally I said I was gonna be clutter free by 2023 but I've had so many things happen in that time frame so it's taken me a little bit longer than two months to get the clutter gone so now I'm just gonna say clutter free in 2023 <laughs> I'm not gonna beat myself up about it we are gonna be clutter free very soon so I'm not going to put so much pressure on myself and you shouldn't either if you're trying to declutter something in your home if it doesn't get t done in the time frame oh it's okay Life happens and there's things that we have to take care of and sometimes you have to pause and it's all right. You will get there. Just keep chugging along little by little. So this video is going to be a little bit different than my other decluttering videos. My husband and boys helped me with the three rooms and they did not want to be on camera. So basically what I'm going to be showing is the before and the after and I will show the mess we got rid of and you won't be leave how much we got rid of. So stay tuned to the end for that. And anytime I tackle a big project like this, I like to stock up on Costco pre-made meals. Keeps me from eating out and spending too much money. Number two is their current bedroom and we sold their bunk beds before they got their new bed so they were currently sleeping on the floor right now.
back I'm not someone you should cheat on Cause when I come back, I come back strong Raise your glass to the sky Let's toast to that All these people can stare I don't care about that This is my pain guys that's it for the three room declutter i hope you enjoyed that if you did hit that like and subscribe button and hit that notification bell when i upload a video i'm not on like a schedule right now it's basically working as i can i think i only have about three more areas that i want to focus on decluttering and one is my clothes um, and the other two areas are the unfinished part of our basement and our garage which those two you know how big those can be but once i'm done with that i think i can start focusing on working on me <laughs> and and my environment will be decluttered now you may be asking okay what about other rooms i think i've pretty much decluttered most of the other areas in our house and kept them decluttered uh these the areas that i've tackled so far is the ones that i've had uh clutter creep get back into. Now if a full home tour is something you're interested in, please let me know in the comment below and I'll do that once I'm done with decluttering the other three areas. But you guys have a wonderful week and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, bye.